Hi guys, Soul Insanity here, and I am joined by Vulcan Cyberger Aliana. Hello, everybody. And today we're going to be ranting, well, I guess raving and maybe even, well, raving isn't the right word. But today we're just going to be kind of talking about gender roles. Okay, yes. would you like to start with what your personal opinion is on the whole, you know, girls stay at home, guys work, Guys are tough, Urgh. and girls are <laughs> fragile. Ah, uh, completely untrue and silly and lots of other mean words. So, which gender role slash stereotype slash thing pisses you off the most? Uh, let's see. I think maybe the stereotype where where girls can't be trusted to make decisions because because their, like, womanly minds will get in the way, or... I don't even know how it's supposed to work. I don't know either. Yeah. That one makes me rage quite a bit. I don't like it when the, uh, when the opposite is true also, when it's like women are like, oh, guys, they can't think. They only think with their penis, and, you know. Yeah, either one makes me mad, because there are, like, there are smart people and there are dumb people and there are people who are more prone or less prone to doing stupid or angry things and and I don't know it seems like uh, anybody could be any kind of person I agree with you so what's the next gender stereotype that pisses you off well Well, well, the one where, well, I guess the stereotype where, I don't know, periods make girls irrational or something. The thing is, I'm kind of, like, the worst possible person to ask about my opinions on stereotypes because I kind of don't know that many, or I just don't pay attention to them, I guess. It just varies from individual to individual. Exactly. Just like anything. It's just like cramps varying from individual to individual. Not that I would know, and not that I would want to know. You guys are tougher when it comes to that than guys. Thank you. Like, I'm not dissing girls. They can go through a lot of shit with their body and make it out alive. Where guys, we just, like, fall on the ground if we get kicked in the balls. You guys can, like, shove a child out between your hips. We that... can make more of us. Yeah, we can't. Yeah, you can, you can multiply. But I'm just saying, like, girls can go through a lot more shit than guys can. And that's probably why it's kind of been a little bit proven that they're more depressed, because they go through so much more bullshit because of our fucked up society. I have to wonder when it all started. Like, a, like my mom reads about these really ancient cultures that were more, like, goddess-worshipping and stuff. Yeah, like some of the Mayan cultures to where men and women were treated equally. What the fuck happened to that shit? Yeah. It's like, why? Uh, because men are assholes. Not all men, but some men are fucking assholes. It's like the ones who are... You kind of, like, gravitate towards power because they're asshole enough to go for it, I guess. Well, it's like the over-masculine guys. It's like, oh... You can't wear pink if you're a guy that makes you gay. It's like, who gives a fuck if I'm gay or not? I am who I am. Or you can wear pink either way. Pink yeah, is a... Exactly. Pink is like a... It's just a color. Somewhere between... Yeah. It's like a tint of red or possibly orange, depending on what culture you ask. Yeah. But it's just kind of ridiculous. I don't think that there should be a gender specification for color. It actually but... used to be reversed. Yeah, I actually heard that. Yeah, like baby blue was girl color. Yeah, there doesn't need to be a girl or a boy color. The right. Co the gender color that you decide is the color that you decide for yourself. Yeah, I mean, it, it's it's just for the benefit of the... the... 
people planning the baby shower anyway. I know. Dude, if I, like, ever have a son, I'm gonna throw a pink baby shower. Or just... Or maybe just, like, a rainbowy baby shower. That'd be awesome! That way the kid can pick the color themselves. Yeah. Or just have it be black... Or just have it be black and white and take it in all black and white photos. And when they grow up, they can, like, put whatever photo tints that they want. Just, like, put it in Photoshop and just add a shit ton of color. Yes. That'd be awesome. I will give you all the colors ever. You do not have to choose, my child. You can choose all of them. If that is what you wish. Yes. You're on a flower pot. I know. I'm on a pot. What? Hmm. My friend, Bye. my friend a couple days ago was high off his ass and he was spamming my phone at 3 in the morning. <laughs> really? Like, he wow. texted me. He's like, I want McDonald's. Wake up, I need McDonald's. <laughs> wow. Hi, people and I thought awesome. that was... Yeah. Anyway, so what other... For some reason, now I'm reminded of Scooby-Doo. <laughs> like Zoinks! If you could just see one change to gender stereotypes, what would you want changed? For there to not be any? Or for, like... I think maybe one of the problems is that people keep on thinking, like, in terms of boy and girl, when really everybody's just an individual person who's mm -hmm. made up of lots of different factors. Mm -hmm. Male gender being one one of those factors and for some people it's a big thing and for other people's it's not really that big a thing at all yeah i agree with you that's why i'm like gender queer sweet because i i don't know i don't want to be an over masculine guy i want to be feminine Aww. i want to like have a skinny body so i can wear like low cut shirts and stuff Ooh, They're I just, think you'd look really nice in that. I think I would look good in the skirt if I had a smaller body. Oh, well, I think you could pull off a, a skirt if you got, like, one of the right shape and color. Yeah, maybe. But it wouldn't look good if, like, any of my belly was showing because I have, like, really bad stretch marks. Ah. Oh. Are you okay? If you could be any of the many, many genders, which one would you conspire to? Conspire to? Be part of, I guess. What would you mm. consider yourself as? Well, I'm actually kind of trying to figure that out right now. It's That's like, okay. Like, I have no idea right now. I just know what I'm not. <laughs> what are you not? Well, female, I suppose. I mean, biologically, yeah, but... Well, I'm biologically male, yet I'm genderqueer, so... See? S similar thing. We're just... Neither of us are cisgender, that's all. We might need to update our position in the pride box. Okay, let's go. Let's update it for the world. Yay! Wait, the gender queer flag is on the bottom, right? Or is this the gender it's queer? A, it's the purple, white, and green one. Okay, so. Oh, hey! I, yeah, You're I know. Still in here. Maria! So, yeah, I'm, I'm in the gender. I'm partly the gender queer flag and the bisexual flag, while Aliana is gender queer and gay. Because she's kick ass like that. Yes. You know what? I know what we should do to make this, this gender thing a lot easier. What? Should we have, yes. like, grids or something? Oh, labels. No, I'm gonna, like, put my name on all of the flags that I represent. Ah, that does make sense. Alright, where is... That way when people go into the pride box, they can just, like, say, oh... These people are represented by this. Ah! I 
dropped my sign. I'll get it. There you go. Thank you. And you don't have to put them in any specific place. You can just scatter them on the flag. Sweet. Now just update that one. But anyway, your mom and sister are pretty cool. Yeah, they are. So they're like some of the coolest dudes I know. <laughs> so is Jim, but he's really quiet. That's kind of his thing. He's he like goes, yep, uh huh, and sometimes I go, ah. <laughs> so he's got a yep, a nope, and a evil doofenspurts laugh. No, more like a... <clears throat> Dark <Jew. laughs> No, it's not evil at all. It's more like... A biker laugh? <laughs> no, not like that at all. Oh, I was just It's very jolly. Whoa, ho, 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 ho. What? No. <laughs> My voice You have cracked. to hear it to understand it, man. I know. I, I have to make small jokes. I joked. I kids. Yes. The pride box is beautiful. Yes, it is. Click the button. I could hear your breathing again. God damn it. <laughs> damn it, Bobby. Was that King of the Hill? Yes. And I watched that when I was probably way too young to be watching that. So I played Grand Theft Auto at like 10. Dang. I'm a little flower pot, you're a ten spout. Here is my disco panda. Here is my flower. Na 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 na. Pan da 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 da. So you missed the commentary I did with Todd last night. I I did. We're Bummer. making we're. Whoa, there's a sign. <laughs> um, Todd and I were making jokes about religion. You've, yeah. Wait, you've played Skyrim, right? Yeah. So Todd's mom was like speaking about like spells and alchemy, and I'm like, Todd, when did your mom become a wood elf? <laughs> and then she was like talking about, oh, blah, 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 you can have spiritual sex. And I'm like, I can't spiritually do someone anally. And... <laughs> wow. And it was just awesome. <laughs> and then, like, she was talking about how, like, God impregnated Mary, and I'm like, what if she was, like, high off her ass, and she was just getting, like, fucked by by God, and she's just, like, wakes up, he said, I was a virgin. Wow. Like, maybe she was on roofies, and she just didn't remember it. That, you know what, knowing... I kind of wouldn't be surprised. Like, Old Testament... Well, I guess it would be the New Testament, but... God seems kind of messed up. He's always seemed messed up. Yeah. Thou shalt not eat potatoes on Wednesday. Oh, do you ever see that thing I sent you? Like, like the Ten Commandments? Uh, the, the Eddie Izzard Ten Commandments? It's funny. No, I don't think you... You might have, but I don't remember. Oh. It was just this guy talking about, so they were wandering in the desert for, for 40 years, but if it were me after 16 years, I'd be saying, where are we going? Yeah, you send me that. I remember that now. And then they're like, and then they went crazy. I'm going to... <laughs> I can't even say it with a straight face, because it's so silly. Yeah, well, we are, like, so off topic, though. I know. I think I'm going to end the video here. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. This is probably going to be in, split into multiple parts and different videos. One for bloopers, one for seriousness, and one for the pride box. Okay, thank you. See you guys later.